Let's talk about Team Mexico. We did. We shot that that deal with you and Sid, and um, we didn't see you guys on on the team uh, when they qualified at the North American uh, Olympic qualifier. Um, is is playing with Team Mexico still a, an ongoing thing? Um, is it a possibility? Um, it's it's definitely an end goal for me. Um, that hasn't changed for a long time. Um, that still continues to be my end goal. Um, things that just get in the way are things like injury, um, life, um, obligations, bills, just things like that get in the way. And so um, I, I had to pick and choose. And then all of a sudden I got hurt. And then that didn't help because now I can't do anything for pride. I can't do anything for Mexico to try to try out for them. Um, but I mean, it's definitely my end goal is, you know, I'd like to, I'd like to go to the Olympics and I'd like for it to be with team Mexico, but, um, I don't know where my knee is at, but as far as like training and everything, like that's, that's what I'm, I'm shooting for. Okay. Definitely. Um, are you a Dodgers or an angels fan? Neither. Neither. What? I'm a Padres fan. Padres. <laughs> I know. I know. Why? I'm, it's just what I grew up. I grew up going to Padre games. Um, anytime I'm home and I go to a baseball game, it's always the Padres. I love Petco Park. Like I just love. I mean, it's a great park. I love them. And you know what? Even though we don't always have the best team, we always have really good players. And then someone else takes them. But we always yeah. do have like really good players that are fun to watch. They just mm -hmm. eventually leave. Yeah. Man. Didn't take I know, you, but if I had for a, after that, it's probably oh, that's tough because my brother loves the Dodgers. Um, but I love Mike Trout. So I probably would have to But you gotta those. love Mookie Betts. I mean, I do. I do. Huge, You're right. Huge deal. Franchise player. Yes. Yes. Do you know that like, his deal, right? Yeah. A uh, 12 year yeah. uh, deal, which uh, Mike Trout also signed a 12 year deal. Um, he's so fun to watch. And he's like an expert bowler. Did you know that? I did know that. Mm -hmm. I saw something on social media where they showed him doing the bowling thing I see on TV all the time where it's like two yeah. lanes. and Yeah. Yeah. I, on the other hand, am terrible at bowling. I'm so bad. I don't know what happened. Like I don't coach anymore and I can't throw front toss and I can't bowl. <laughs> you know what? I have just tried to bowl like I'm playing softball. So like, I don't even use all of like the finger holes. Like I just will do, and throw it like curl it up in my arm and just throw it as hard as I can. That's I okay. found that I find that that works. Okay. You don't get a lot of strikes. Sometimes you get a lot of gutter balls, but if you put yeah. the you bumpers put up, the it helps. Okay. Do yeah. You try to get I the try spin to put on the spin. it. Okay. Yeah. If I can look cool once out of twenty times, we're good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Does uh <laughs> how how does how is Sid uh, against you bowling wise? Have you guys bowled against each other? Each other? We have. It's been a while. Our grandma, she was in like a bowling league and she's like, she's good. She's like, she does all the spin and all, all of it has the little like hand guard thing that they wear. Mm -hmm. You know, she's like serious. Um, Sydney actually, I think, you know what? No, I don't think Sydney's that good actually at bowling. Okay. All right. We can't be good at everything. What'd you say? She does a spin. She said, okay. She's, she's so she's spin. copying you. <laughs> <laughs> basically, basically.